What's up guys, Chris VA Travels. I'm in downtown Fredericksburg and I just took a tour of the St. James house. And it, yeah, I just took the uh, house tour, no filming inside, a ah, real bummer. And uh, for anybody who's a fan of antique furniture, I would definitely take a tour. And uh, the highlight is they've got an original painting of King George III uh, in, in a golden frame. I don't think it's pure gold, but a golden frame with, uh, with a crown on top. And this place is only open twice a year, one, work, one week during the spring, one week in the fall. So it was a good tour. And yeah, I figured since I, I came all the way out here, I'd, I'd make the most of it and uh, just put up a little video for anybody maybe who lives in the area wants to know a little bit more about the house. And uh, start off, I'll tell you, it was built 1768. And uh, it's great, it's still here. Most of these wooden houses, uh, wood frame house obviously, uh, don't survive. If it's not burned down, it's actually usually uh, water damage is what gets them. Yeah, and I can tell you the uh, portion on the left, that's original from the 1700s. Uh, the little building on the right was originally a kitchen, a detached kitchen, it burned down. They re rebuilt it in the 1800s. Uh, and then sometime in the 1900s, they built that little cut through. Yeah, inside they've got the uh, original floors. Uh, yeah, so uh, anyway, so yeah, it's the uh, home, was, it, it's most famous, it's the home of James, Murf, Mur, uh, James Mercer prominent Fredericksburg citizen uh, during the, he lived here during the Revolutionary War during the colonial period and he was a lawyer a judge a uh, member of the House of Burgesses uh, fought in the uh, French Indian War his actual brother was actually killed in scout during the war and he was also Mary Washington's attorney he uh, drew up her will so <laughs> And uh, the house sits on, this land was originally part of Kenmore. And yeah, Kenmore uh, owned by Fielding Lewis, uh, married to Betty Washington, George Washington's sister. So uh, also uh, some nice, so in just a name drop real quick, while he was a judge, he admitted James Monroe, Chief Justice John Marshall, uh, another prominent Fredericksburg citizen, Virginia Governor Robert Brooke to the bar. And uh, he's also cousins to uh, George Mason, actually. His father ended up uh, raising, actually, George Mason. It's kind of a, a long story. His, uh, George Mason's father, father died young, and he kind of uh, adopted uh, George's mother and George Mason. So anyway, so after that, uh, the house was also the childhood home of Jane Howison Beale. And I've mentioned her before. Her brother was John Howison. He built... Uh, Brayhead Manor, and uh, <clears throat> she, uh, she this was her childhood home. She grew up in a home right across the street from Mary Washington's house. It was a blue house. If you go down Charles, make a left on Lewis Street, and that's the house she lived in during the Civil War. So yeah, she's famous. She wrote a diary of what it was like to live in Fredericksburg during Union occupation. Yeah, pretty neat. All right, so yeah, I think that's uh, that's all I've got on, on this St. James house. So like I say, just a quick one. I'm going to get out of here. As always, uh, like these kinds of videos, like and subscribe, and see ya.